Standing next to Jeff Burton, number two in the NASCAR scene, and uh, recently just unveiled the new Nastia Lucan. Well, one of one of the uh, Olympians or soon to be Olympians on the car. Who's on the other side? Michael Phelps is on the other side. So we have uh, you know the most decorated swimmer, I guess, of all time on one side, and and uh, a new young up and coming on the other. That's it's a great match. Now, are you a fan of the Olympic sport? I love the Olympics. I, I really do. I, you know, the thing about Olympics, the Olympics is, is I didn't grow up around gymnastics. I didn't grow up around uh, a lot of sports that you see when you watch the Olympics, and you watch them because it's your country. You know, you, you're pulling for your country, so you get exposed to other sports, and then you, and then they do a great job of exposing you to how they got to where they are. And in the case of gymnasts, it's amazing the age that you know how committed that they had to be at such a such a young age. Uh, you know those things are just those stories, those personal interest stories. I think are really cool. And you know I don't whatever sport you're doing, I think it's all it's different, but it's the same. You know it, it takes determination, it takes effort, it takes desire, it takes talent. But you know you see that in all different kinds of sports, and that's to me what the Olympics all about. You have that spirit, and then they're doing it for their, their country. That's a that's a really neat deal. What does it take to be a race car driver? That's a good question. Not a big brain. Um, you know, I, race car driving is no different than, than any other sport. I started racing when I was uh, seven years old. Uh, it's what I, I'm 41 now. My whole life, well, I'm soon to be 41. My whole life, this is what I've done. Um, obviously, you have to have a talent that, that, you know, God gave you. But you also, you also have to work at it. You have to hone it. It requires... Uh, uh, it's different than most sports. You, I'm 41 years old, and I'm at the prime of my career. Most sports, when you're 41, you're you're not you're not doing it anymore. Yeah, so. gymnastics, you're definitely done. Yeah, and, and so that's a great thing about our sport is that you can do it well into your 40s. And and what it what it requires is uh, determination, effort. The races are really long, and and. So, you know, not every day goes well. So when things aren't going well, you had to know how to make things work. You got to still, you know, find a way to make something good out of it. How big is the, the schema on the car, the paint scheme? I, I, to me, I, I really like the Olympics. And the cool thing for me about this is that now we're going to expose a, a NASCAR fan to Nastia, for example, that, that I'd be willing to bet the majority of NASCAR fans you know, maybe not have heard about Nasty, but now they're gonna they're gonna look at who is that on the couch, and, and it's gonna create interest, and that's you know that's what's cool about it is that we're gonna we're we're saying hey NASCAR fans check this out you know be sure to watch it on TV be sure to pull for them, and it's kind of our way of supporting the athletes and you know to me that's fun. How fast does this car go? This car goes uh, tops you know 205 208 miles per hour. Uh, we could go faster than that, but there's a corner on the other end, and uh, so we run we run everywhere from a half a mile to two and three quarter mile racetracks. Well, I'm sure Nastia uh, had no idea that she was going to be going 205 miles an hour around a race car trip. <laughs> exactly. I'm I'm sure she will. Thank you so much for the time, Thank and uh, and thanks for you know representing the gymnastics and the Olympic well, movement. We really appreciate we it. We appreciate it.